Hey guys, I'm Kike. And I'm Kathy. And today, we got a little craft for you guys. We're gonna do something very fun. All right? I so, like fun. What, you like fun? I like fun. You, do like you guys fun? like fun? I like fun stuff. Tell me, what are we gonna do? All right, today, we're gonna make a painting with the first letter of our name. Okay. Yeah. All right. And so how you do it is you grab some tape, any, any masking tape that you can put on a paper, and then you put it on this paper in the shape of your first letter okay. of your name. In our case, actually, are you going to do your real name or are you going to do Kike? I'm going to do Kike. Because if we both do K, then we can see which K turns out the best because they're the same letter. So, I'm <laughs> definitely going to have the best K ever. So, what we're going to do... <laughs> What we're gonna do is with these paints right here, we got a full set of colors, and we get to choose our colors. We paint them over the masking tape with our letters, and we'll see which one's the best. All right, let's do this. You ready? I'm ready. I'm ready. First, we're gonna make the K, right? All right. You make so yours first. I wanna make my K. And then I'll just copy his K. See, that's why you know my K is already better than hers. First you watch and you learn, and then I know how to make mine better. That's the key. I think there it'll look go. good once you paint it. All right. Yes. This is a pretty color. It's called turquoise. 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 I'm gonna start by mixing my red with my white and making a pink because I love pink. And I, since I already got some turquoise, I am just gonna spread it across the top. So I'm just dabbing it here and just a little bit so it's not too much. And I just Yeah, because you're just focused on colors. I'm focusing on getting the best K ever. If you were like an artist, like what kind of art would you make? I would make nature, mostly. Like good views of like nature. Like any kind of nature. Which is kind of the route that I'm taking right now. Nature? Yeah. But what kind of nature is what's going to surprise you? At this point, I think I'm just doing the same thing on the whole paper to kind of set a background. Okay, alright, great excuse, great excuse. And then I'll figure out from there <laughs> what else to do. Because, <laughs> I don't know. Guys, there you go. If you're I'm ever doing. in an art class, mess up badly all you gotta do is so you're just making the background brush it and say you're making the background <laughs> you're saying that you're making some kind of contour yeah, just just keep doing what you're doing and just cover the whole page the same also the colors that i'm using kind of remind me of like my childhood room this is what i had pink and purple pretty much yeah. everywhere so i still love the pink and purple my colors do too actually yeah? Yeah. I have turquoise, uh, turquoise, deep sea blue, and blue. Uh, yeah. We still love the same things. <laughs> I guess I'm getting into a competitive, really artistic moment. I'm just like, I'm gonna make something amazing. I think in the genre of being creative, you you get a little bit stuck most times. I think I'm gonna go with some yellow. Well, and that's true because most of the art that I like is like copying an image. Like I don't like coming up with my own stuff because it's really hard. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it just is. I prefer, like I said, I copied your K. It just, it's easier. <laughs> but now we're battling. And now we're in competition mode, yeah. So now I have to come up with my own thing. So, uh, I was gonna say flowers. 
Is that allowed? Why do you even use gray with such a colorful thing? I don't know, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't want to add too much color. Got it. Yeah. Do you get that? <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be a blooper. 